thinking about a wedding present for you and Lulu. Look, I know that you guys don't want me to, you know, we're, we're good. We're fine. Okay, I'm, I'm not taking your money. How about a, a better idea? How, how about if I make a donation to the hospital, a pulmonary wing, in your name? You gonna just donate a whole wing? You said it's all right to use the money for a worthy cause, right? Yeah, look, <laughs> there, are, there are plenty of worthy causes, okay? You want to send them your money, you feel free, but leave my name off of it, okay? I'm not going to be your excuse to buy your way to redemption. I'm just trying to do something good here. The doctors at General Hospital saved your life. I was shot in this your This has warehouse. nothing to do with the shooting, Dante. You give money to the hospital every year to whitewash your image. I'm your... I'm your father. You got married. I'm trying to find a way to honor that. How about a, a pasta maker? Or, or a Does nice this have to do with She has a problem with me? No, Is that what's going on here? This actually has nothing to well, do with Well, when you came to me, you know what? You didn't know I was your father. We got along fine. Well, maybe we? I was a better liar than you realized. We're a lot alike. You know, Whether the, you want to admit it or not. Great. You know the one way that we're irreversibly different is I'm a cop. And, and you don't realize how difficult it is for me to keep my name clear of yours to begin with. I, I don't need you donating money to the hospital or doing anything else in my name. Family means more to you than you want to admit. You're right, it does. Family means everything. Except I'm not going to look the other way when a family member of mine breaks the law. You covered for Michael, didn't you? Well, how long before you expect me to cover for you? At the scene of a murder, you told him to leave before he would get in any more trouble. Michael didn't kill that guy. Why? Why? Why do you know that? Because your brother said it? He, you, oh, your gut told you he couldn't do it? Yeah, yeah. It's called cop's instinct. Okay, but deny it or not, you know what? You would do anything to protect your family. Look, Michael already did time in Pentonville, and I helped put him there. I'd be damned if I let him live that nightmare ever again. You did the right thing. And if, if it were my kids, I would have done exactly the same thing that you did. Okay. So that's, that's what this is all about, isn't it, Sonny? It's the thin blue line taking a back seat to family. Blood is thicker than water, Damn right? Damn straight. Okay, you, you, always, you always play the family card, Sonny, whenever it's convenient to you. Sonny Corinthos, a uh, loving father and hospital benefactor. I mean, that does have a really nice... Dante, can you just listen for one second? I'm just trying to do something meaningful for you and your bride. You know, it's a, a wedding gift I would really appreciate is if you just quit the business. Become a full-time coffee importer. Hell, just retire, I don't care. Just, just stop being someone I have to keep tabs on and just be my father. Could we try this a different way? You ever think about putting down your badge? Not for you, not for anyone. Okay, let's compromise then. Anytime that it's just you and me, us, right? We'll put our job aside and, and just be a family. The uh, barbecue we talked about. Yeah. Yeah, that's great in theory, Sonny, just not so good in reality. Dante, it's good to see you. Yeah, you too, Kate. He's all yours. You don't have to leave. No, Dante, you don't. Dante. We've, we've <laughs> got to settle there is to say. Hey, Sean. Hey. How's Wilson? Ah, uh, the new dog walker's got nothing on you. Ah, oh, I'd love to work with dogs if only I wasn't allergic to them. Yeah, well, at least you try. Hey, gorgeous. Oh, my day is getting better. Hey, what happened? Uh, you know, just uh, quality time with Sonny. Uh, he's raising the stakes in the uh, family bonding department. As if there's yes. nothing I'd like more than, than my name permanently etched next to his at the hospital entrance, you know, the Dante Falconeri pulmonary wing as gifted by Michael Corinthos Jr. Okay, well, the name is a mouthful, but think of all the people you'd be helping. <laughs> That's what, what pisses me off. I mean, he knows how much I care about a, about a cause like that. So I said, go ahead, D donate all you want. Just keep my name out of it. Well, he's trying to have a relationship in a twisted yet touching way. That's what makes me crazy, okay? He's got, he's got this sincere part of him. And, and then this other part of him that's just manipulative. Well, maybe he's trying to have a scratchy father-son thing like my dad and Lucky have. It's completely different, baby. I mean, Luke was there for Lucky his whole childhood, okay? They have any problems together, they have those memories to fall back on. Hey, hot dog walker. Uh, who are you? Easy, man. Can't handle a little competition? <laughs> wow, this is uh, my husband's. Hey, what did I just tell you about being a smartass? That you love it. Sorry about that. Uh, that's, that's okay. He was here the other day. Who is he? Uh, T.J. Ashford. 
He was getting himself in trouble at home, so his mom gave him two choices, military school or here. Why here? I fought with his father in Afghanistan. He was killed in a friendly fire accident. Oh, that's terrible. Yeah. He showed up at Kelly's out of the blue. You know, I want to do what I can. Uh, how's it going? It's a little bumpy at the moment. No, but Molly's been great. You know, I offered to help him with homework. I just hope TG I'm doesn't blow. I'm about to knock on her door and ask Kate for my job back, and she comes storming out in full-on diva mode. See, now, now you realize what you've been missing. Well, I'm not a fashionista. No matter how hard I try, I can't get passionate about hem length. So, what, uh, what, what now? I don't know. I just... I want to find a job and stay busy so I can stop angsting about my passion. Detective. Uh, Dr. Keenan, this, this is my wife, Lulu. Hi. Nice to meet you. Uh, Dr. Keenan's the uh, therapist we brought in to help out with the case. I had another thought about our perpetrator. This behavior isn't new for him. Uh, it's likely he had a pattern for assaulting women long before coming to Port Charles. 